tripod thingy stand thing. So now I have to Today, hold the phone like we're this. We're going to. <laughs> Shut up, dude. We're going to pick up RX7 and Yeah, that's, that's what we're gonna go do. I don't like this. This is tripping me out. <laughs> now we're going to Miami Raps. They said the car's ready, so we are about 10 minutes out. Dakota's coming with me so he can drive the Prius back. I thought I gotta drive the FD. Actually, yeah, you know what? Drive the FD so I can take B-roll of you driving it. If it blows up on you, it's your fault though. No. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see you guys in, in a bit. Back. Oh, the shop is closed. This food truck is thick, boy. Thick, boy. Oh, I see the FD. So I remember saying I was gonna go cream white, but they didn't make cream white in the 3M, so. Oh, oh. Let's go, baby. What's up, what's up? What's up, man? Oh, snap. I wanna pull it out in the, in the light. This is it. What is it called again? Charcoal? Metallic, metallic charcoal something. Oh, I gotta make sure to shut my hood. We'll pull this thing out in the sun. And I've been waiting a long time for this day for the FD to be painted. I mean, one color. <laughs> Still gonna paint it eventually, but Enlightenment Wraps did a great job. They got everything done. I like this color though. It's pretty cool. It matches the. It matches the Supra, huh? The rear end looks like Origin. <laughs> it's so sick. Yeah, it does look good, man. Instagram right here. <laughs> Hit him up if you guys need a rap job. You guys are open five days a week, right? Five, six days a week. Six days a week. Me and Cutter are gonna go head out now. Are you gonna drive it or no? You wanna drive it? This will be comfier, right? Yeah, but I wanna get some good B-roll of this thing. And we're gonna get on the road. Is 
top of his car. Go, go. So cool. So cool. Why is it cool? Why do you like it? plan for today dude don't mess up the new paint bro this gonna suck because the previous paint they didn't mask it well so it's on the mold that sucks so i want to paint it it green's gonna show a lot like let's go uh, get the hachi dude here she is this thing is like running on two cylinders so getting spark plugs, new fuel filter. I'm gonna try and get this thing running with its own power, its own 40 horsepower. But figure you can do something with it while it's here. I am not too sure what I wanna do with it. Pretty convinced I wanna keep it stock, just like my other Red 240 and just have these like in the future. Two bone stock cars from the 80s and 90s. I know for a fact they'll be worth a lot of money one day. They're already worth a lot, but who knows? Maybe I can just throw some coils on here and make it look kind of cool. It's really boring right now, but let's get this thing off the trailer. All right, should we try and bump it or you want to give me a push? This thing weighs like four pounds. Yeah, I want to do this car is ridiculously easy to push. Get it, Coda. <laughs> is this your morning power walk? <laughs> so last night I was tweaking a bit and took off the lens covers and cleaned them. So I got to throw those things back on because this car looks weird without them. doing over there bud what are you doing all right so I cleaned these things pretty nice I was gonna trade for regular pop-up headlights what do you guys think I should do Coda thinks these are cool but personally I'd rather have pop-ups I don't know preference, I guess. Well, my camera died, but I was able to get these lens on. Pretty nice. Still, I don't know how I feel about these. Koto, how do you feel about these lights? Do you like OEM flip up or? Well, it's a memia. It's really rare. I guess. I guess they're they're rare, so whatever. I'll keep them for now, unless someone wants to send me some flip-ups, and I'll try. I just hate how they look so scratched at certain angles. Like, certain angles, they look super minty. And then... What are those? I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Just got done washing this thing. It came out amazing. It's been in the garage for like a year. I for sure have to take off all these stickers. It does not look good at all. For those who haven't seen this car, I've had it for quite a while now. I picked it up in the Bay Area and this thing is like straight up time capsule. It's almost exactly the same condition is the red 240 I got but it's a Hachi five speed everything's just so nice on this car oh cool what next Let's go check out what Coda's doing. She's cleaning or what? Yeah. 
This car needs help. I'm supposed to work on this Hachi right now. I'm too lazy. Gotta put new fuel filter and spark plugs. Hopefully it fires right up. It'd be so cool to bring this thing around, just daily drive it, bring Coco to school in it. All about the OEM cars right now, just all stock. It's so hilarious. A little pro tip, whatever leftover sauce you have from your car wash. I know it might be kind of dirty. I don't really care. These are trash, but pressure washer done. Let's clean these things. Yeah, I guess they're all right. These things are pretty beat. We'll let them dry out, but better than before. All right, guys, I'm seriously all over the place right now with these videos. I have so much going on. I'm supposed to work on all these things, and now I gotta go work on my dad's drift car. I just loaded all of these up, by the way. It's looking pretty sick. Got some fresh Kumos. Got the old tires, need to dump those. I can throw those in storage because I don't want them just sitting out, but this guy has been sitting since we bought it because we need to get this part welded. It's like cracked right there. So homie James is gonna come over and get that thing welded. I gotta rip this thing out of here. That's out. Probably gonna end up raising this cage or whatever this dinky little doo-doo is. We gotta raise this up quite a bit so it doesn't happen again. It's way too low. I don't know why it's down there. I'm probably gonna have James cut these and raise it. It'll probably sit about right there. Way better. Gotta actually make new mounts for all this stuff too. This is super janky. What is going on? That is not, not good. Coming from uh, what you guys seen on Gabe's car, this is definitely not the way you wanna do it, but hopefully this thing doesn't have any type of gas in it. Yeah, it looks pretty empty in there. Probably smart to pressure wash this thing since it's had fuel in it. We don't want any explosions. I mean, it was empty, but still, safety first. Take a break until James gets back. We are gonna try and swap these plugs out and see if it actually runs. It's the moment of truth. Let's see if that helped anything. Fuel pump or I don't know, it's not starting now. All right, well, I guess next thing we're gonna do is change this fuel filter. We got a new one and I don't know, go from there. Well, James is here and he's gonna... Gabe, pick up your trash, bro. Oh, cool. Where's the thing up. thing? You oh. messed up about this guy? Hey, that's going to be like messed up. Really yeah. I bring him gifts and he just kicks it around. Hey, you look fresh, bro. Yeah, like cool. new cut. Some new clothes? Yeah. Where'd you go, Ross? Now went to TJ Maxx for me. So we got this culprit right here for the for the leaking of the fuel. James is gonna test out his duct tape skills. His dang, everyone's fresh with the cuts today, huh? Yeah, actually, uh, Nick was just talking about you guys. He's like, yeah, Josh, this is coming up, and then you know, oh, you guys is here. We all go to the same barber, same huh? Barber. We all go to the same barber. He's the greatest. He's the greatest. <laughs> James has never tig molded before, so no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> he brought his his gear. Yeah. Luckily, we got the 220 plug right there. Let's get it. What is that thing? Torpedo. It's a fudging musket. It's is that argon. a fudging musket? It's argon. So this is what you need to dig? Mm-hmm. I like your stance, bro. Couple passes. Yeah. Because James hasn't welded in like... Like six, months. six months but dude you're on fool you're ready for this this is like nothing 
Hey, you freaking weirdo, dude. James isn't proud of his work. <laughs> it's just That's I perfect! Can, I can smell the gas burning off it when I'm welding it. I know it's still dirty. You can hear the crackle. Yeah, you hear it, right? I mean, it doesn't help that this is a gas tank. This thing is not gonna leak. Thank you, James. You're welcome, bro. Well, we're gonna try and get this thing in the car. I don't think we're gonna do this. I'm gonna save the work for you to do, Gabe. You can do this tomorrow, huh? I mean... I took it out, you put it back in? You know, just shoot me some money, we'll figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> You're my brother. And I love you too, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> Today was super random. So much footage. Dude, I literally filmed like the most random stuff today. Really? It's, it's going to be clips and clips, and I'm sorry, guys, but I'm going to go in and edit this video now. You guys can do whatever you're going to do. Bye.